Like, All right, yeah. so I had talked about this on the show last week or the week before. I said I was going to get the best Nick Gage tweets of 2019 and put them together, and I have done so. Um, it was difficult. Um, I was going to do a really? top 10. Well, it was difficult because I wanted to do top 10, and I said, f*** that. There were so many good so ones? So many or... good ones, yeah. There were yeah. okay, too yeah, many I to like. Yeah. So um, I'm going to link them to you guys as I uh, – Okay. Talk about them so you guys can. <laughs> okay, so. Sure. <laughs> All right. So here's the very first uh, Nick Gage tweet of 2019. Uh, so Nick Gage <laughs> is going to face Hornswoggle at Adventures <laughs> in Wrestling in March of 2019. He tweeted, I'm going to fuck this little dude up, MDK. <laughs> and it's a picture of Hornswoggle smiling. <laughs> that match was awesome. If you haven't seen it, you got to see it. All right. So. Um, that's that one. So this next one here is pretty good too. <laughs> Hold it's on, about... before you get to that, someone said I read, I did not read up. So if you read it, I'm gonna f this little dude. <laughs> <I'm decaying>. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here's the next one. Yeah, this one has to do with Scott Steiner. This one was from February of 2019. Why the fuck do they call Scott Steiner <laughs> the booty man? What's that shit supposed to mean? It sounds suspect, to be honest. It's all good, though. <laughs> I'm fighting this guy at NYC tonight, so it's whatever. I'm not intimidated by anyone, so I guess it's going to get ugly. We will see what happens. MDK. <laughs> Dude, in that fucking Steiner match, at one point... <laughs> Gage throws him out of the ring and he says, Get the fuck out of my ring, Big Papa Pump. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you gotta go full nickname? Why do they call Scott Steiner the booty man? It's our suspect, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here's a good one. Um, this one has to do with uh, when <coughs> Gage was facing, uh, or he was talking about Jake Atlas. Okay. Uh, this one was from October, so it was recently at the end of the year. All right. I was just told Jake Atlas is a good guy, and I should chill out because he has a lot of cool stuff coming up. <laughs> Do I look like the type of guy that gives a fuck if he has cool stuff coming up? I was fighting for my life in these streets for a long time. I don't care about cool stuff. <laughs> Oh, it's got 420 <laughs> likes on it, too. Do I look like a guy that gives a fuck? It's <laughs> cool stuff. He tweeted something. About, I think he, he, like, followed that up afterwards. I don't remember. I'm sure. It's about Orange Cassidy. I don't care if Orange Cassidy has cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> That's really oh. good. Speaking of Orange Cassidy, um, Nick Gage had one right here where they did uh, an Orange Cassidy show. GCW did an Orange Cassidy show. Or, oh, yeah. Um, I was at that. Yeah. So here's the tweet. This is some weird shit. The dude actually looks like an orange. <laughs> it was like the poster for the yeah, show. Yeah, the poster was an orange. <laughs> <laughs> and speaking of pictures that Nick Gage reacts to, this next one is a wombat. And Nick Gage greets <laughs> it. He goes, the f*** is this shit? Oh, please tell me you got the one. <laughs> oh, well, I have a guy. You know guy. what one oh, I'm talking about. Oh, hold, on, hold on. So, GZW, I'm guessing <laughs> the, the Wombat show. Okay, so Nick Gage all yes. year long has no fucking clue what his Wombat show is. I mean, he all year he has no clue. I'm pretty sure Nick Gage was on one of those shows. <laughs> he was on both of them. <laughs> yeah. He has no clue. <laughs> what the Wombat show is. Okay, so Nick Gage reacting to more pictures here. Here's a good one. So, someone drew a picture of Nick Gage. <laughs> As a chibi, and Nick Gage said, <laughs> he retweeted, he goes, WTF. <laughs> oh, here's a, okay, uh, this is probably one of my favorite ones. I think I actually posted I hope this, this like is four the times. One I'm talk, I'm okay, so here's a good one. Uh, what oh, is no, Stan? <laughs> <laughs> what is Stan? <laughs> people, people were saying they stand Nick Gage. He goes, What is Stan? <laughs> um, okay, so the next one here, uh, this is a good one about etiquette on Twitter. Nick Gage, my boy just told me I should stop using the word bitch and pussy on my tweet post because it's not a good look. That was some of the softest shit anyone ever said to me. <laughs> oh, and there's a really good one too. This one's about Cody Rhodes. 
Oh. Nick Gage, I seen Cody Rhodes in Las Vegas, and I swear he looked at me real weird. I've been thinking about it a lot lately. I'm pretty sure he <laughs> don't want to fight me, but I don't know. Maybe he does. I'd smash that dude and gladly run his pockets, but I don't know. I'm probably just <laughs> overthinking it. He might be a good guy. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> I'd run his pockets. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably ever thinking it. He oh, might be a good guy. Here's dude. another good one. It was about the Seth Rollins versus the Fiend match. Nick Gage. I thought Rollins was about to pull a light tube bundle out from under the ring and smash the Fiend dude with it. Shit would have been awesome. Make that motherfucker bleed. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's how we all felt, honestly. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, here's another good one from Nick Gage about uh, boneless wings versus bone in wings. Uh, Nick Gage said, a boneless wing isn't a chicken wing, it's a chicken nugget. Why do people get caught on that? It's fucked up real tall. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucked up. Shit fucked up. Oh. <laughs> now here's a really good one. Uh, Nick Gage. I'm going to be real honest with you guys. I don't know who Eric Andre is or what he does, but he can join my gang if he wants to, as long as he ain't corny or a cop caller. MDK. That's because... Eric Andre like put on his fucking like Snapchat a picture of him. <laughs> How y'all's you guys? I don't know who Eric Andre is. <laughs> okay. You can join my gang. <laughs> so, <laughs> all right. So this next one, these are these are uh, the next couple are probably my favorite, personal favorite. Okay. Um. All right. Here's one. I'm excited. What yes! is this supposed to be? <laughs> you guys are fucked up. Is that an alien? Someone drew a <laughs> Squirtle. In an MPK outfit. <laughs> Every time I see Chris Statlander. <laughs> and then the follow-up tweet from Nick Gage. What is Squirtle? That shit, just, <laughs> that shit just doesn't sound right. Any man who knows what this is or that plays with some Pookie Man card has a real problem. <laughs> Let's be real. Pookie Man. <laughs> That's the real shit. <laughs> All right, so oh. that's that was one of my favorites. These next oh. ones are probably my favorites. So <laughs> <laughs> for the collective, for the collective, Effie is running a show called Big Gay Brunch, and he announced a uh, wrestler named Razor Ramon Hard Gay, and yeah. uh, Nick Gage has never heard of Razor Ramon Hard Gay. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> and he quote tweeted the initial post and said, "That don't look like Razor Ramon." <laughs> <laughs> Nick Gage is not. Oh, I, got, I didn't see that one. <laughs> that don't look like Razor Ramon. And then Nick Gage follows it up. Oh, and he says, no. Effie, what's going on here? Let me know because I think I missed some shit. <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't stop there. And what is hard gay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my. That, those are like my three. I don't look like Razor Ramon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't look like Razor Ramon. What is this? And what is hard gay? <laughs> Uh, oh, all together, Nick Gage had one hell of a 2019. Uh, his tweets oh my brightened my days for many, many months. There was almost one for every single month of the year uh, that <laughs> made me smile. Uh, and what is hard gay? Uh, uh, 